Hey guys, what's up Virgo? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with, somebody around you. So flip it how you need to. Also remember, it's a general reading. So just take what's yours, leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Also, if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that's below as well. Alright, immediate future with the word for the birds. King of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Energy. Doesn't have to be though. That's a very um, determined energy. The Six of Wands. Somebody may be getting some type of raise or promotion. The Six of Wands though is, is happiness. It's, it's kind of getting, you know, obtaining some type of, or trying to. The King of Pentacles. Your energy. There could be two males here or two masculine energies. This may be all the same person though. It could be an emperor here. It doesn't don't necessarily go off gender though. It's the energy. Show me this king of swords. Okay, thanks. So yeah. Somebody walked away from something. Oh. I might have snuck away. But somebody may have like withheld something. Or walked away like in order to keep something. But the four pinnacles, that's that's about holding on. Uh, you definitely may have more than one option here at the bottom. Because you're coming in as the queen of the queen of wands. Or depending on what side you're on here. We have the seven of swords and the four of pinnacles. The four of pinnacles is, 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 I mean, somebody's definitely holding on to something here. I don't know. Show me that seven of swords. Sorry. You, yeah. The Empress, Taurus, Libra, energy. Ooh. You may have a decision to make or uh, you have like a greedy person. Somebody, maybe greedy is not the right word. It could be somebody who's really money hungry, but somebody who does not want to let something go. And my guess is... That would be you coming in as the Empress. Show me the Six of Wands. If this isn't around like a relationship thing, um, like as I, as like I was saying, there could be two males that are here. So it could be like around a family situation where I mean, you know, trying to like hold out on something, or even if it's like a, a piece of property, or you know, maybe you're dividing up the house or whatever. I don't know. But it, it could have something to do along those lines as well. Show me the Six of Wands. But the fact that we have the Empress up there. Yeah, now the King of Wands. Um, Aries, Leo, Sag, Energy. You have very... Yeah, this person's not going to want to let go of this. This is somebody with a lot of pride, a lot of confidence, a lot of ego, a lot of swag. There's that devil. High sex drive. Um... That's Capricorn energy. This is probably an X or there was something very sexual there. However, we have, I mean, the, either way we go, something around a car could be here as well with the chariot cancer energy. But it's not for all. This could be like withholding money as well. But this is just the energy of somebody who is, who's usually probably used to getting their way. Um very like dominant energy here but somebody who does not want to lose something let go of something they're trying to move forward here there is a choice that's coming or you know about it could just be about moving forward but this person's not going to want to let you go this could also for some um uh, it could be something that's very sexual or has been in the past this could also be something like along the lines of since the Empress is up here, like if you were the breadwinner or something like that, financially, this person got a lot of uh, confidence to them, though. They're trying to reconnect with you, rekindle, hang out. Show me the King of Pentacles for the outcome. 
you may have a, a choice to make, but it feels like there's one person here that, you know, you're sitting up here in your power, beautiful, or vice versa. Um, I don't want to just make it all towards like the females, but you do have somebody about to approach you and it looks like they're going to offer you something for some pretty freaking serious. There could have been like a legal settlement, a legal win around something. Somebody could have hit the lottery or got like a large sum of, sum of money. Show me the King of Pentacles, please, for Virgo. For the outcome. Thank you. Yeah, the Eight of Wands. You got communication coming. This person's going to approach you. I don't know if... Oh. There's that Ten of Pentacles. Oh, sorry, Ten of Swords. Ten of Swords represents some type of ending here. Something may end in the back. This doesn't have to be for all. But, um, you know, sometimes this could be like a married man or something. But you could have more than one person here. Some Somebody, you know, there could be somebody end up feeling betrayed by the end of it. What is that Ten of Swords? That's not for all, though. It depends on, you know, what kind of situation is going on in your specific world. Show me this Ten of Swords the wheel damn whatever this is it was meant to happen with the with the wheel there that's a car Whew. there's that freaking money there's that that it doesn't even have to be money but there's that ten of pinnacles tell me more about it's like some type of ending over here leads to growth there's your emperor the high priestess. You have somebody here who kind of, in some situations, it's like have your cake and eat it too. Maybe not around through the hard times. But you definitely could have somebody that's kind of sneaking off over here in order to hold on to something. The Ace of Cups. Looks like one thing's ending so another can begin. But yeah, the Page of Cups, the Ace of Cups, you could have brand new love starting, but you definitely have communication coming towards you. Could be an invite, which could lead you with a, um, a choice. You got this one energy here in the middle, though, and this could be all the same energy because now we have the Emperor and the Empress. So, um... Now, for some, you're going to reject this or not take it. With the four of cups there. Just be mindful of. Unless I guess you have options. Be mindful of. Okay. But this is real love over here. So if it's something that's brand new starting. And so this person's not going to want to let you go from the past. Either way, I mean, it's it's love, but if this is a, there's a past person, a past situation is definitely going on from the jump. All right, Virgo, I hope this helps. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that information is below as well. You guys take care, and I'll see you next time. Bye.